last few days about needing booze or Lynn to step up, and they really did it in the third quarter. Was there, like, a, did you have magical words at halftime, or what happened? No, no magical words. Just, uh, you know, I talked to Jeremy before the game, you know, about just being a little bit more assertive and, um, you know, uh, getting out of his comfort zone, you know, just, you know, just being assertive, you know, on both ends of the floor. And, you know, I thought tonight he did that, especially in the second half. This is the first win that this group has collectively had. Did you sense any difference after the game talking to these guys in terms of, okay, now we're kind of on the same page? No, not really. I mean, they were all pretty uh, quiet in there, to be honest with you. I think, you know, and, you know, what I said is, you know, okay, that's one. Let's, let's go up here to Memphis and New Orleans and see if we can get a couple more. You know, so I don't think nobody was, you know, overjoyed in there. It's, you know, it's a win. Let's move on, get ready for the next one, keep getting better as a basketball team. Um, but I'm sure they're all pretty happy that, you know, hey, let's, you know, we got a win now. Let's just kind of move forward. Hey, why did you guys win? What did you do that was you were pleased with that got you the victory? I think we won because we had 100 and something and they had 90 something. <laughs> well, you had to do something <laughs> no, to get just, to that. You know what? We just, we did a better job defensively. You know, that's what we've been talking about, you know, since September 30th. Uh, you know, our guys did a much better job of understanding what we want on that end of the floor. Uh, you know, our principles tonight, we didn't make as many mistakes, you know, defensively. I think the first half, they had, they had nine offensive rebounds. They beat us to every 50-50 ball. You know, the second half, you know, we were aggressor. Uh, I think they had one offensive rebound at the end of the third quarter. You know, so we just did a lot of good things defensively, and I thought our guys stayed in it. You know, we tend to sometimes stop playing you know, when shot goes up, you know, thinking that the play's over or somebody else is going to rebound. So tonight we just finished off plays, especially in the second half. You said nobody was celebrating in there, which makes sense. You know, the team still won. Right, but right. you did say it's important to get this win, to get the monkey off your back. I think you used that phrase a couple times this week. Do you feel that after getting this win? Well, again, like I said before, it's just a process of just trying to get better each game. You know, this is a game that we felt was very winnable. You know, so, yeah, it was important to kind of get this win to, you know, start this road trip. We're playing two very tough teams, you know, back-to-back -back Tuesday and Wednesday, Memphis and uh, New Orleans. So uh, it was important for us to get this win to go in there with a little bit more confidence. What do you think is the key for being able to replicate this kind of effort where you have the balance on all of Well, if we can get four more days off and keep working on some stuff, that might help. <laughs> but since that's not going to happen... Uh, you know the NBA. You know, just games come fast and furious, and you just got to be ready to play. And um, tomorrow we got another day of practice and going over some things that you know that we did well and some things that we didn't do well. And like I said, it's you know, for us right now every day with the group that we have that hasn't been together that long. You know, we got to be uh, you know on our P's and Q's. So repetition is very important for us. Were you pleased with the Kobe, other guys, balance? Yeah. Yeah, I, I thought, again, you know, Jeremy, you know, was more aggressive. Booz was more aggressive. The guys weren't looking to just, you know, get the ball to Kobe and, and move out the way. Guys were trying to be more assertive, and that's what we need. We need guys to step up. Barry, you've seen it all in the league, but this streak, was it weighing on you personally at all? I mean, you're talking about almost two weeks. Not really. I mean, it, from a standpoint of just being pissed off, mm -hmm. you know, and wanting to get a win because I know we're better than our record is, you know, but other than that, no more than any other loss or win. All right, that's Byron Scott. Much more to come on Access Sports and Lakers. Coming up, more Lakers post-game reaction is Kobe and the